Ever heard of a financial app that gives you instant cash back and helps you manage your money, all for free? Sounds too good to be true, right? Well, companies like Coho are making waves in the fintech world by offering exactly that. But here's the thing, Coho isn't exactly a bank. So, what exactly is it, and where does your money go? Let's ditch the confusing financial jargon and break it down in a way that makes sense. Imagine Coho as your financial buddy, it helps you track your spending, offers rewards for everyday purchases, and even lets you set savings goals. Pretty cool, right? But unlike your traditional bank account, Coho doesn't hold your money itself. Here's where things get interesting. Coho partners with licensed financial institutions to provide their services. In Canada, for example, they work with People's Trust, a chartered trust company. This means your money is actually held by People's Trust, which is a safe and secure institution with deposit insurance. So, even though Coho itself isn't a bank, your funds are still protected. Now, you might be wondering, why not just go with a regular bank then? Well, traditional banks can sometimes feel clunky and outdated. Coho, on the other hand, is built for the digital age. Their mobile app is user-friendly and lets you manage your finances on the go. Plus, the instant cash back on everyday purchases is a sweet bonus that most banks simply don't offer. Think of it this way, Coho is like the sleek and modern financial app, while your traditional bank is the reliable but slightly old-fashioned grandpa of finance. They both serve a purpose, but Coho might be a better fit for those who value convenience, rewards, and a more digital approach to managing their money. But here's the thing, Coho isn't the only player in this game. There are a growing number of fintech companies offering similar services. So, before you jump on the Coho bandwagon, it's always a good idea to do your research and see what other options are out there. Consider factors like the fees involved, the types of rewards offered, and the features that are most important to you. Ultimately, the best financial tool for you depends on your individual needs and preferences. If you're a tech-savvy person who wants a convenient and rewarding way to manage your money, then Coho could be a great fit. But if you value the security and traditional approach of a brick-and-mortar bank, then sticking with your current setup might be the way to go. The important takeaway is this, with the rise of fintech, you now have more choices than ever when it comes to managing your finances. So, explore your options, find what works best for you, and take control of your financial future. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.